Hello and thanks for joining me. My name is Heather Forgan. I'm an independent Stamping Up demonstrator based in Scotland. My website is stampwithnelly.com. Today's video is just a quick one to show you these fabulous um, swaps that I've received in the post from some of my fellow pootlers. Each catalogue launch we tend to um, have groups of people that will create multiples of a project and post them out in the mail to each other so that we can inspire each other. Um, so I shared a, a blog post a few days ago with what I had created and sent out. Um, so now I'm just really letting you see what I received in return. So I'll go through them one by one. Just to the side for a moment. And uh, this cute little card um, is from Yvonne Flitton. Yvonne has used the um, Ornate Garden Suite. So she's used some of the designer series paper from the suite and she's also used the Thanks stamp that's here. And the stamp that she's used that says sending you a paper hug, that one is from the Comfort and Hope stamp set um, and she's got that beautiful cinnamon cider ribbon on there. She's also sent this which again uses the Ornate Garden designer series paper. Um, I did have all this open previously. Um, she's also used the, the stitched nested labels dies. Um, and there we have a lovely double tea bag uh, holder. And coincidentally, that was the tea bag that I sent with my swaps to these lovely ladies. So, this one, there's no gluing at all. It's pieces six by six by the looks of it. Yeah, six by six designer series paper and a few very clever folds. And that goes together. Love it. Might have to try that one out myself. Excellent. I will put the contact details so um, Yvonne's website and her blog, etc. in the in my blog post. And there'll be a link to that in the description below. So this one was from Sim. She is papercraftdesigns.co.uk. She's used these fabulous little acetate boxes. All of the, well, most of the project products the ladies have used will be in my blog post as well. Um, so this one uses the Forever Greenery Suite. And she's made four beautiful little cards with coordinating envelopes using products from that suite. So she's used the embossing folder um, and the gold laser cut paper on that one. Um, she's fussy cut her sentiment on that one and another bit of that gorgeous gold there. This one is a watercolour effect where she used re-inkers by the, the looks of it. Beautiful. Love that effect. That's really pretty. I'll need to try that as well. And this one where she's, she's used um, circles and it's raised up on dimensionals. Gorgeous. What a lovely little gift that would be um, to make those... Um, a little set of cards, pop them in that box and add a, a belly band with some of the die cuts. Um, this sentiment is from Field Journal stamp set, I think. Nope, that was Hillary's one. That one is from Butterfly Gala. That's right. Yeah. Beautiful. As I say, I'll put a link to Sims 
blog and her YouTube in my post. So this one is from Hilary, who is um, Dutch, or certainly she, in her blog posts, etc. Um, they're written in Dutch. Um, I would still thoroughly recommend you have a look at Hilary's website and uh, check out her YouTube because even if you don't understand the words, you will be wowed by the projects. They're fabulous. So Hilary's card is on grey granite card and she has used the Fancy Phrases bundle. And this is silver foil that has been embossed with the Dainty Diamonds embossing folder. Um, we've got silver heat embossing there, she's stamped uh, tone on tone there and those lovely little bits of ribbon. Sending a little smell your way, keep it in case you need it sometime. Isn't that cute? That's gorgeous. So she's also enclosed this little tag, she stamped the, the envelope as well and the tag, I'll take the ribbon off again, um, isn't that just a beautiful shape to that and to be honest I hadn't really paid too much attention to that um, but I have now <laughs> so that's the fancy phrases um, bundle with this gorgeous stamp set and that very pretty uh, delightful you know, scalloped tag topper punch is it? no it's not that one is it? whichever punch it is is beautiful love it gorgeous um and hillary has obviously used wink of stella on that i don't know if you'll be able to see that shimmer on there um which when you you stamp and then use the wink of stella it will kind of drag some of the color into the center there which gives it a bit more depth love it beautiful and last but most certainly not least is this one from Karen Matthews. Now Karen doesn't have a blog or a YouTube channel just yet, but I think she definitely should do. Um, I absolutely love this. Her masking is perfect so that she's not overlapped the stamps. So this is the Tasteful Touches stamp and this is the one that she's used there. Um, but she's obviously, as I say, masked the areas off so that she's not overstamped, which is just fabulous. And I love the, the, the two colours, the new in colours, um, Bumblebee and Just Jade together. Very, very nice. And with that little extra detail in there as well. Beautiful. And linen twine. Can't go wrong with linen twine. Love it. Fabulous. So I hope you've enjoyed seeing these swaps today. Um, I've certainly loved receiving them. Um, it's always nice to get a happy meal, regardless of, of the, the reason or the season. Um, and it's great to, to receive such beautiful projects from such lovely, talented ladies. And I'm very blessed to have them I'll be in the same team as them. Thank you very much for watching. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I'd love it if you would do so and click on the bell to make sure that you get notified of my next video. Until then, take care. Bye bye.